Crime Statistic 2015. Welcome ladies and gentlemen, the world ain't a safe place and there's crime out there. Next month the police will release the official report for Germany for 2015. Already the media has some numbers, the links are in the description below. What can I say about the crime? All in all from 2014 to 2015 crime did rise for 4.1%. This means all in all 6.33 million cases at all. 40% of those cases are death. Death did rise for 1.8%. And you see the numbers always, how much percent say they rise and behind how many cases this are. Shoplifting and pickpocketing did rise for 7.1%. Car death did rise for 0.3%. Bicycle death get lower with 1.3%, but still it's a high number as you can see. Sexual assault and rape minus 4.4%. All in all just 7022 cases. So not a lot of sexual assaults and rapes happen in Germany. Even including the New Year's attacks and, and the migrants or the refugees already there. But who knows what will be in 2016. Burglary plus 9.9%. This means every 3 minutes there is a burglary, ha burglary happen in Germany. And this is one of the major issues we face in Germany at the moment. Even in my small more rural town area it's very common that you hear about cases and I know even some cases where they broke into the houses. So and who are committing those crimes? As Eastern European gangs mostly from Georgia, 40% of them from Georgia, then from the Western Balkan states and from the Maghreb areas. Those are mostly the offenders and uh, have a little rate of um, catch those offenders. So burglary is a crime where you can get away very very easy and this is several reasons because we have 16 states in Germany and every state has its own police and the, the different police states or the state police do not all share the information but the burglaries or the criminals don't stop at the borders inside the country or with the open border politics in Germany and it's also a fact that many Georgian guys from Georgia or from the Georgian mafia are moved in with the refugees just in my town they catch that guy by by burglary and he's coming to Germany since 2004 so he coming every year or almost every year apply for a asylum seeker in this meanwhile he gets some money and some accommodation and then he commit crimes for his gang how to deal with such a situation when you have those die-hard criminals that are have a very antisocial behavior should you send them to prison? Maybe bring their death penalty back? What are your opinion about such die-hard criminals that are a threat for the public safety? All those numbers give not a really idea about um, how the living situation is at all. When you see that burglary did rise for 52% from 2005 to 2015, it's a giant rise. But there are some numbers, a Germany map, where you see burglaries, where the red areas, the more red is, the more burglaries there are. Then you see the violent crimes, it's the same, the more red, the, the hot spots. And there is the general crime rate. And you see it's very different from state to state and even area to area. And the last picture show how many crimes they can solve or catch so far. This means the quality of living really really depending in which area you are living. It's more common in certain areas in Germany to become a victim of a crime of burglary, uh, of burglary, death, 
pickpocketing or even a violent crime than in other areas. So I hope with this information you can choose where you want to go in Germany. Stay safe guys. Till the next time. Thanks for watching and cheers.